Come on, come on, come on, just go. Alright, go! Oh, that is horrible. I'm up at Killy Lane Reservoir, and today I'm on the hunt for something that has been hidden for decades. All over the, the country are on various hilltops. You'll find these concrete posts called trig points, which is short for trigonometry, and they were used by mapping companies way back decades ago to create maps for around the country. Here's a nice place, right, let's keep going. Um, and most of them are on quite accessible hilltops that have got roots to the tops and paths. But there's one here in Ballyboli Forest beside Killy Lane Reservoir. It's got no path to it and probably hasn't been seen by very many people in a long, long time. But today I'm going to try and find it. You might be asking the question, hey Stephen, isn't that an absolutely miserable day to be going for a run? Yes, it is! <laughs> There's a perfectly good path on the other side of the reservoir there, but where's the fun in that? I have to get from here over to that that corner. Um, let's see if this is actually actually possible. Oh, it's miserable, but the sun is over there, so I don't know. I think we might actually get a little bit of sunshine in a bit. There's something incredibly refreshing about running in wind and rain. Oh, it's immediately mucky! Oh. Oh. Whoa! Maybe this is why I've never went this way. Oh no! There's a mucky bit up ahead I don't think I can avoid, so that means only one thing. I must run through it as fast as I can. Let's go! forest. My feet are a little bit damp. Oh. Why did I go this way? If I went via the path, via the... this way, I think. Where am I now? Suffice to say, I'm completely lost. <laughs> right. Okay, now I'm trying to find my way out of the forest to get back, back onto the path. I think it's this direction. I'm just kind of, I'm just kind of guessing here. <laughs> there it is. Oh no, brambles, shorts. Right, okay. That's me back on the path. And I think for this next bit, I will just uh, travel by map. So I've just found a really, really rare plant that you really don't get to see very often here. And it only grows in a few special places because this is actually the native Irish coconut. Here it is here. And it sprouts out on certain trees and it almost looks like a coconut that's been cut in half and filled with a mixture of fat and seeds. And then you'd be forgiven to think, thinking that the stem was a piece of twine used to tie it to the tree, but no, it's actually a, a type of coconut bird fungus that grows here. 
and uh, it's a tasty treat for the local, the local wildlife. Sun's out! Woo! <laughs> Until the next cloud comes. Sharp right turn. This is where I turn off and go straight in among the trees. My plan is I'm going to take a slightly longer route up um, and then I can take a shorter route back down again. Whoa! Look at that. That's a root system of a tree. That's massive. Oh. This is like passing through the gateway to some kind of big adventure. Do, 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 do. I've come, I've come out from onto the trees because this fire break, as far as I can tell, heads directly up to the top. So I shall follow it up, see if that gets us there. <laughs> There's a lot of obstacles. Ooh. Oh, that's scratchy. Ow! Smack me in the face. It's covered in some kind of weird slime. Ooh, that would be quite painful to snag yourself on. Onward! <laughs> Immediately fall on my face. I can't imagine it's a particularly popular route. There is definitely a little bit of a trail up through here, uh, but I do know there are a few like really local runners who would go up here on occasion, but those are the only people I've ever seen posting anything from up here. So I think we're at the top. More logs and detritus to work my way through. Is this it? I think this might be it. I see. Oh, it's opening. It's opening. Ow, ow, it's hurting. And I see it. <laughs> oh, hold on. There's a tree. Okay, so this might not be just as not well known as I thought it was. <sighs> Ta da! The lost trig point of Kinnaird, or Kinnaird, or whatever this mountain is called. Yeah, and maybe not quite as unseen by human eyes as I was suggesting, but definitely it's not a popular, it's not a popular trig point. You can see the brackets still on the top of it here. This is where they would have like mounted an instrument onto the top of that, which would then use light or some kind of science magic to see one on the top of another mountain way somewhere else. Obviously when that was the case, there were no trees here. But uh, yeah, that's it. The sun is just trying to come out to finish off my video. And yeah, I think I'm gonna finish here having discovered the lost pillar of Canard. I had planned on putting the drone up and getting like a downward shot, but it's far, far too windy for that. Don't wanna risk it. But uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did like it, feel free to subscribe for some more. Have a look around the channel. There's other types of videos on here. I make videos about tech, running, the outdoors, and just every now and then having a random rant. So if you didn't like this video, go check out another one and you might like it even less. Thanks for watching.